Risky Project comes with a comprehensive risk planning capability that includes a risk mitigation response plan view, the risk mitigation waterfall chart. Once you have entered your initial risk assessments into the risk register, you can begin to create your risk mitigation and response plans. Typically, your choices for risk management strategies are accept transfer, mitigate, or avoid for threats, and accept, share, exploit, and enhance for opportunities. If you decide to mitigate the risk, you can develop mitigation plans. They are presented in Mitigation Response Review. Plans can have sub-items, which make up a series of steps that will be taken to minimize the probability or impact of the risk. For example, you may want to move a risk from red to green on the risk matrix. Once you have entered the plan, you can now be assigned to a risk using the mitigation waterfall chart. Open the risk information dialog box of the risk to which you want to assign to the mitigation plan and click the mitigation tab. On the left, you can see the pre-mitigation and post-mitigation status of the risk. Click in the first row and select the mitigation activity you want to assign to the risk and add an estimated date of completion. This plan will be shown visually on the chart in the waterfall format. The impact of the risk mitigation plan is also reflected on the post-mitigation cube. As you add activities, the cost and cumulative impact of the plans is plotted on the chart along with the total cost of the mitigation. Waterfall diagram shows both planned and actual changes in risk score. Actual changes in risk score are taken from the risk history presented in the Risk History tab. Open the Mitigation Response view and you will see that the plans have been assigned to the risk. Plans can be assigned to one or more risks. The Mitigation Plans risk plans are reflected in the post-mitigation probabilities, impacts, and scores, as well as the risk matrix where Arrow depicts changes to risk score due to risk plans. Response plans can also be assigned to risks. They are used to model the cost of response to risks if they occur. They also are defined in Enter, these plans to the Mitigation Response view.